say your name and spell it first. My name's Sean Rogers, S-E-A-N-R-O-G-E-R-S. -E -E okay, awesome, thank you. Um, how long have you been playing for the old Miss hockey team? This is my first year. I just transferred from community college down on the Mississippi Gulf Coast. Okay, um, and you are a? I'm a junior. Junior, okay. Mm -hmm. um, you said earlier you were from uh, Biloxi and stuff? Yes. And did you play high school hockey there or anything? Um, I didn't play high school hockey there. I played on travel teams, but when I was 15, I actually uh, shipped off to a boarding school in Lake Placid, New York, the Northwood School, and I played prep school hockey there for three years. Okay. Um, the game, um, how, how did you feel the whole tournament? What was the feel around the team? Um, well, last year was our first was the first year for the program to go to regionals. So this year, you know, we, we kind of met our, our spot from last year, and we went in uh, kind of to exact revenge on Loyola University of Loyola Maryland. So, you know, we came in with pretty calm heads there, and uh, once we got that win, you know, at that point we've gone further than we have before, getting a win at regionals. So it's kind of a you know nothing nothing to lose, everything to gain. Situation. Now, after the win against Loyola, um, did you feel like you had confidence to go out and make it to Nationals from there, or did, did you all know before then? Um, well, we didn't know who we'd be playing at first. Um, eventually, the options were down to Arkansas or Florida Gulf Coast University, and uh, we ended up with the Alabama advancing over South Carolina. We ended up having to play Florida Gulf Coast University. And earlier in the year, we played them um, in Pelham, and they beat us nine to four. So at that point, you know, it puts a little seed of doubt in your mind. Um, when you played uh, Florida Gulf Coast, what, what, uh, what would you say some things that stood out about that game, like individual um, performances by certain people? Uh, well, you know, coming coming back on the ice in the second period, down three zero, you know, we went out and. Uh, Dan Warnicke got a couple of goals. He's a he's a freshman this year. He got two goals that period, and then uh, you know we were kind of got it down to a four two lead, and then he came in. He he scored again in the third period, and we were up uh, we were up got up to five four after uh, Seth Palchic scored, and then after Florida Gulf Coast uh, tied it up in the third, we went into overtime, and Warnicke just made two great moves around defensemen and came in and just you know, put the goalie away and ended the game. And so he, he really stood out and so did uh, Josh Huckel, our goaltender this weekend, you know. They were high scoring games, but you know, he still kept us in there and definitely definitely gave us the wins there. How did, uh, uh, what's up next for y'all? Up next we'll have, uh, actually kind of in between nationals and now we have the SEC HC tournament, which is the Southeast Collegiate Hockey Tournament. Um, we kick off against Florida, and then from there we don't know yet who we play in the bracket. So that, that'll be our next game. And then later on in about a month, March 12th through the 16th, we'll go up to Missouri for national tournament. Okay. Um, do you know who you're playing in the nationals yet? Um, so far we put in, uh, in a pool where we'll, you know, we'll play all the other three teams, and so far it's Colorado State University, Farmingdale State College from Long Island, and uh, the third team is Adrian College, their gold team. They actually have two, one's gold and one's black. Okay. okay. That's...